Welcome to Profit Passion Fruit Farming and today we're going to be covering on nutrients needed by passion fruit. We have major nutrients and micronutrients. And the major nutrients we have uh, nitrogen, potassium and phosphorus. So nitrogen is more needed on the growth stage from the young vine to a free grown vine. So we require for the vegetative growth in a passion fruit it requires more of nitrogen then it is also needed by a vine after doing pruning so it helps to regenerate the vine and produce more suckers for more production then we have number two phosphorus it is needed to help root development and the root strengthening hence it helps the longevity of the vine so the vine can stay for long and very healthy since it can correct or it can uh, uptake more nutrients due to more well developed roots then we have number three potassium potassium help the passion fruit uh, production or help to increase fruit production and also help in uh, en ensuring that there is high quality fruits. Micronutrients are also important since they help the vine to increase flowering activities and fruit production. So when it comes to uh, mostly like boron, it helps the, uh, to avoid flower abortion. Also other micronutrients help to strengthen and to protect the vine from other diseases. Here are some signs that you can see and note what type of uh, nutrients is lacking in your uh, passion fruit. So when you see a yellowish leaves, this means there is a lack of nitrogen nutrients. Hence, you can add a fertilizer rich in nitrogen. Number two, if you go to your farm and you notice there is light fruit and a fall of a grown or a fully formed fruit, it is caused by a deficiency in potassium. And hence, if you note this, uh, there are some fall of fruit, you can add potassium in your uh, vine or in your farm. And Finally, if you see flower falling or flower abortion, you should add or use a, spray, a foliar sprayer that is rich in boron. And mostly, it also has some small quantities of the other nutrients in order to help the vine to uh, grow or to be more productive. Uh, before we end this video, it's good to caution or to take a caution so note ensure you don't add more fertilizers often since it can lead to a opposite of what we have said before so due to excess vegetation so you might have a decrease in production due to excessive vegetative add small quantity after some few months five to seven months so if you add a, day, uh, a period of five to seven months, it will be okay. Thank you for watching. And if you need more videos on uh, the signs or the physical features or uh, 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 signs that you can use to identify which type of nutrients is lacking, please comment before, below. Thank you. For